Have you ever wondered about the secrets that lie hidden within the icy worlds of our solar system? Beyond the familiar faces of Mars and Jupiter, there's a tiny moon circling Saturn that's causing a big stir. This is Enceladus, a mysterious world shrouded in ice and intrigue. Enceladus may be small, but don't let its size fool you. This moon is home to a global ocean, tucked away beneath a frosty exterior. We're not talking about a small pond here, folks. This ocean completely encircles the moon, a vast expanse of water hidden from view. But what makes Enceladus truly unique is its geysers. Imagine fountains of ice and steam erupting from the surface, a spectacle so grand that it can be seen from space. This moon is so active that it's even contributing to one of Saturn's rings. Enceladus, a tiny moon with an ocean of secrets, is more than meets the eye. What secrets lie beneath Enceladus's icy exterior? This question is more than mere curiosity. It's a scientific quest that could redefine our understanding of life in the universe. Let's delve into the fascinating world that exists beneath the frozen surface of this Saturnian moon. At first glance, Enceladus appears to be a cold, barren world, its surface a pristine white veneer of ice. But don't let appearances fool you. Beneath this icy exterior, there's more than meets the eye. Enceladus harbors a global ocean, warmed and kept liquid by a process known as tidal heating. Now, you might be wondering, what is tidal heating? It's a phenomenon caused by the gravitational dance between Enceladus, Saturn, and its neighboring moons. As Enceladus orbits Saturn, the moon's shape is slightly distorted due to the immense gravitational pull of its parent planet. This distortion generates heat inside Enceladus, much like how repeatedly bending a wire creates warmth. This internal heat melts the ice into a vast subsurface ocean, transforming this small moon into a dynamic, active world. And when we say dynamic, we're talking about a place where the icy crust cracks and shifts, where towering geysers of water vapor and ice particles burst from the surface, and where the ocean floor might even be warmed by hydrothermal vents. It's a realm that's both alien and strangely familiar, a place where the laws of physics and chemistry as we know them still apply. What could exist in such an environment? Could there be life forms that have adapted to these extreme conditions, just as life on Earth has adapted to our own diverse habitats? It's a tantalizing possibility, one that drives our curiosity and fuels our exploration. With its icy exterior and a warm ocean underneath, Enceladus is a world of contrasts. It's a testament to the universe's capacity for wonder and surprise, a reminder that even the smallest of moons can hold the biggest of secrets. It tells us that no matter where we look in this vast cosmos, there's always more to discover, always more to learn. And that, fellow space enthusiasts, is the true beauty of exploration. Could Enceladus's hidden ocean be a cradle of life? This question has intrigued scientists and space enthusiasts alike. The icy moon's subsurface sea, warmed by tidal heating, offers an environment that could potentially support life. Let's imagine for a moment, a world beneath the ice in the heart of Enceladus. An ocean, not unlike those we have here on Earth, teeming with organisms too small to see with the naked eye, but playing an enormous role in the ecosystem of this alien sea. Here on Earth, we find life thriving in the most extreme environments. From the boiling hot vents on the ocean floor to the freezing cold conditions of Antarctica's Lake Vostok, life has a way of adapting and surviving. These extremophiles, as they're known, are a testament to the resilience and adaptability of life. So, could similar life forms exist in the depths of Enceladus's ocean? Scientists speculate that the answer could be a resounding yes. The presence of water warmth from tidal heating and organic molecules discovered in the plumes of Enceladus all point towards the possibility of microbial life. But we're not just talking about any life, we're talking about life as we don't know it, life that has adapted to conditions vastly different from those on Earth. It's a tantalizing prospect, one that could redefine our understanding of where life can exist. Now, you might ask, how can we prove this? Well, Future missions to Enceladus aim to gather more data about its ocean and the intriguing plumes that jet out into space. By analyzing this data, we may one day confirm the existence of extraterrestrial life. The possibility of life on Enceladus adds a new dimension to our quest for extraterrestrial life. It propels us to push the boundaries of exploration, to delve deeper 
into the mysteries of our solar system and to continually question our place in the cosmos. In the grand scheme of things, we're just beginning to scratch the surface of understanding the potential for life beyond Earth. The mysteries of Enceladus fuel our cosmic quest for discovery. This icy moon, a mere speck in the grand tapestry of our solar system, holds the potential to redefine our understanding of life beyond our planet. It's a tantalizing prospect that has sparked the interest of scientists around the world. Our journey to Enceladus is not a simple one. It requires a blend of technological prowess, scientific curiosity, and a thirst for exploration that transcends the boundaries of our Earth. Over the years, we've sent numerous missions to study Saturn and its moons, each venture bringing us closer to unraveling the enigma that is Enceladus. One such mission is the famed Cassini, which revealed to us the existence of the moon's subsurface ocean and the geysers spewing water into space. These discoveries have led scientists to speculate that Enceladus could potentially harbor life, a notion that was once considered to be the realm of science fiction. But our journey doesn't end there. Future missions, like the proposed Enceladus Life Finder, aim to dive deeper into the mysteries of this icy moon. These missions would analyze the plumes of water vapor for signs of life, taking our understanding of Enceladus to new heights. Yet, the quest for discovery goes beyond Enceladus. It is a testament to our insatiable curiosity, our relentless pursuit of knowledge. It's about probing the unknown, pushing the boundaries of our understanding, and exploring the endless possibilities that our universe offers. As we continue our cosmic journey, Enceladus reminds us of the endless possibilities that lie within our reach. This small moon, hidden in the shadow of Saturn, might just hold the answers to some of our biggest questions. It's a beacon of hope, a symbol of our quest for discovery, a testament to the power of human curiosity. And so we continue to explore, to question, to discover, because in the grand scheme of things, we're just starting to scratch the surface of our understanding. The universe is a vast, unexplored frontier, and Enceladus is just one of the many mysteries that await us. The quest for discovery is a journey without end, a journey that we're all a part of. And what a journey it is.